have you all read this book by Rachel Carson The Silent Spring This is the story about a beautiful village The village was once surrounded by beautiful forests the mornings were filled with the cheerful songs of birds the air was alive with the chirping of sparrows melodies of nightingales and the gentle cooing of doves but suddenly one day everything had changed the villagers woke up to a strange silence the birds had disappeared and the village felt empty with their delightful tunes concerned the villagers investigated and made a heartbreaking discovery they found lifeless birds near the fields where farmers had used a pesticide called ddt this chemical meant to protect crops had unintentionally harmed the birds the villagers realized they had to take action to bring back the birds and restore the harmony of their village we have all heard of the beautiful rainforests of amazon these rainforests had wild animals which thrived in their natural home beautiful blur- birds fluttered around the trees while the energetic monkeys swung and played in the branches but then a serious problem arose the forest faced dis- deforestation due to farming logging and construction and the mighty river started to shrink as trees disappeared the habitats were disturbed and the forest grew quieter the songs of birds faded and animals struggled to find their homes and food people now realize that they have to take action to protect their beloved rainforest today the mission to safeguard the amazon continues people work tirelessly to preserve its rich biodiversity ensuring a future where wild animals can thrive in and the rainforest remains a vibrant heaven for all in the ancient land of india the ganges river flowed with a sacred aura revered by millions who considered its waters holy people gathered at its banks to worship seeking solace and spiritual renewal but as time passed the river faced a grave challenge water pollution caused by human activities factories and negligence the once pure waters of ganga grew polluted impacting the health and well-being of those who relied on it Alarmed by this environmental crisis, the government stepped in, implementing rules and regulations to curb the damaging practices along the river side. The Namami Gange project was initiated, which was a beacon of hope for river's restoration. Through the dedicated efforts of scientists, environmentalists and communities, the Ganges slowly regained its purity, bringing back life to its waters. So the take home message is that we need to know the impacts of our actions earlier we know the about the impacts the better in this video we look at how to generate reports in open lca reports help us to forecast environmental impacts with pre- with precision open lca gives you comprehensive assessments of climate change carbon footprints and also the intricate effects of inflation we can also leverage the insights gained from open lca to prioritize our actions give corrective measures optimize processes and contribute to a more environmentally conscious and resilient future in this video we will see to how to define a project from uh, the product system pet bottle production 
So uh, once we have created the model graph of the pet bottle production, we can we are ready to create a new project. So we uh, come to the projects, uh, set up a new project, and uh, we will name it pet bottle report. And then we click on finish button. Uh, since all the uh, setups are ready, we we are ready to create a report, and uh, we can choose the LCA method, the method which we want. Uh, to analyze the different uh, categories of the pet bottle production we are going to choose the LCIA method here I am choosing CMLIA baseline method to uh, find out the impact category so to do that we need the open LCA LCA methods uh, to be installed in open LCA which we have already discussed in the first uh, video and then once we have the LCIA method, uh, which I have already said, the CMLIA baseline method is what I am going to choose here. Uh, of course, there are AWARE, BEES, accumulative energy demand, other uh, LCIA methods are also there. But uh, I am choosing CMLIA baseline. Here, the different impact categories are shown here. Uh, so, we have abiotic depletion, acidification, eutrophication, freshwater, aqu aqua, ecotoxicity, global warming, human toxicity, ozone layer depletion, photochemical oxidation, terrestrial ecotoxicity. So, all these parameters can be uh, are discussed in the uh, project uh, setup. And uh, we, we can also uh, compare two product systems if we have already one. But uh, here we have already only got the pet bottle production. So there is only one option which uh, we can choose that is the pet bottle production. And uh, the amount uh, is 1.065 kilogram in full. So uh, it has already been done. And then uh, we can now uh, click on the report uh, button that is already available in the pet bottle report. Uh, just uh, clicking on that it will calculate and the results will be available in the form of a project report. And here you can see there is only one option that is pet bottle production that I have already chosen. And if you want to know the units of each of these abiotic depletion, acidification, the units are given here and the uh, LCIA results are available here. Units are also given at the uh, right hand end. And uh, um, most of this uh, will be in kilogram equivalents and in uh, decibels. Some of them is in decibels. So uh, these are all single indicator results and you can see uh, I can um, change the different impact categories and find out the uh, results of the uh, project that I have already done which is on uh, pet bottle production. So uh, different categories are shown here and the contributions of the various uh, processes that has been done uh, is also um, shown here and uh, uh, the relative results if you have two categories if we have pet bottle production and pc bottle production relative results can also be shown as option one and option two but uh, here we only have one so uh, relative results are not applicable here uh, there is only one category pet bottle production but uh, in the next uh, project we will be doing uh, the comparative contributions of two types of productions uh, so uh, the various indicator results are shown here and uh, you can see that uh, the values if you want the approximate values it is also given here and uh, uh, basically the impact categories which are uh, most prominent are being shown here in the pet bottle report. So there is no need to have, uh, no need to uh, write a report. Uh, it is easily available at the open LCA uh, and um, the, depending on the type of category that we have chosen, the process and the uh, contributions of uh, each and 
every impact category is being displayed so that is how we uh, do the pet bottle production you are watching htech tutorials for more educational content like share and subscribe